We are here at this undisclosed building in somewhere in uh, Orange County. We've heard rumors that uh, Scion is going to be uh, getting into the drift scene this year. And there might be something going on in here. So follow me. Let's check it out. So what's going on? What's this uh, project about? Um, well, we're building a new drift car for 08. You know, we're kind of out of the loop for 07. Okay. So, so this is RSR's comeback. Yeah, RSR's comeback from 2008. And then we decided, you know, we want to change it up a little bit. We mm -hmm. came out with the S2000 initially, right. and then we're like, well, we need something new and something that's different. Mm -hmm. So we, uh, you know, we kind of collaborated with a whole bunch of people that we knew. Right. And we thought, hey, why not try Drift the Scion? Because well, this is no one's ever seen it before. This is definitely something new. Seven. Eleven. Uh, basically, what we started with was a Scion PC. Uh, that was normally a front-wheel drive car. Um, what we wanted to do is we didn't want to run it um, with, since this car is the same thing as a Caldina. The engine was normally transverse where it's that engine and tranny. Um, we didn't want to run the transfer case and all that and still leave the engine that way. Like say like Caldina how... Caldina is a Japanese Corolla station wagon. Yeah, yeah. It's station wagon which is actually, believe it or not, pretty much identical chassis. Um, so everything, what we started finding out was subframe wise uh, in the front and the rear. It all bolted up uh, with you know, my, you know, minor modification. Okay. But we didn't want to keep the engine transverse and the transmission on this side of it just because it's not right. What we ended up figuring out was we had, if we stuck with the beams engine, it's at least it's a four cylinder. It's pretty compact, and we just crammed it as far to the, to the firewall as we can, and we got it far enough back to where we didn't have to modify the firewall just to get the engine in and keep it at the same level of uh, so the factory TC engine sits. When I even thought of the idea of shifting a Scion, initially I was like, I don't know if this is going to work. Well, the team I'm driving for this year is the RSR Scion, and the car we're driving is the RSR Scion TC. I control the car in a sliding manner. It's drifting, it's going sideways. 